Hello everyone, what is going on and welcome back to my channel for another video today. Now, as I mentioned in my last video, which was a uh, the Titan class of the video, is I'm going to start just uploading the gameplays what I do have saved on my computer. Because like I said, come Black Ops 4 release, no one's really no one really is going to care about like IW gameplays and Black Ops 3 gameplays. So, I'm just going to upload the ones I do have as a separate video. No real topic, like normally, you know, I'd get two gameplays or one map and then make a video on it. I'll just upload them really nearly just so the fact that you can see them. Because I've worked for them, I've went out, I've stuck the specific class that I've on. Sometimes it's like difficult, like it's not the easiest thing to do. And I've had, a, obviously, it's took us a few times, a couple hours to actually get. So I feel as if I might as well show you guys them because you might enjoy them um, rather than them just sitting on my desktop and not being uploaded at all because then um, that's just me wasting time working on them. Now, having said that, this gameplay is actually uh, showcasing the Rack 9. Now, the Rack 9 is actually. I, I love the Rack 9. I don't normally use shotguns, you know, SMGs, ARs, or LMGs. But um, the Rack 9 is seriously really good. And an annoying thing about it is everyone I know has got the Rack 9. <laughs> The nuke variant, the, the radioactive, I believe it's called. Except me. Everyone I know, like Luke, Jay, Tom, Nebby, all of them have got the Rack 9 nuke variant. But none of them want it. Only me who wants it has not got it. Which is really annoying. So I was using the Rack 9, I believe it's called the. Um, it's Godsend or Lance. I can't actually remember what it's called. I think it's Godsend. But uh, the, like, the little things what this weapon does is every three kills you get a different perk so if you get three kills you might get ghost and then you get, might get momentum and then you might get dead silence it works like that and it's actually really effective because if you do get the good perks like for example ghost then maybe it's hardwired and dead silence they can really really help you so that's a good idea to have on a gun and the second little like mini perk it does is it increases the damage range so for shotguns that's great obviously you always want more range on your shotgun so you can just like map them people so and this is actually a double brutal gameplay and I wasn't expecting to get a double brutal with a shotgun because obviously of the fact that you always need to be in enemies faces and like I find it easy to play with an SMG against like people who are like when I need to be up close to them but I was playing really well this game and I was just one popping everyone it was actually really fun to use this and I do recommend using the Rack 9 just to mess about because it is a very good shotgun to just mess around it has, it's a very good and it just you can have fun with it rather than like the DCM8 and the Reaver what requires effort to use because it's pretty bad now having said that, I do hope you enjoy this gameplay, and uh, please just let me know what you want to see, and I will see you in the next one, thank you so much for watching, and peace. Composer for closure, I'm popping a perfect to hurt and I don't think it works, so wait